Now for the next section or the next item on the list, we have configure workflows to run for manual events. So let's take a look at that. So going back to the repository to our file, let's let me rename this to main.yaml. I mean, you can give any name you want. And we are going to name the workflow as manual workflow. So now we are going to trigger our workflows manually for this section. So on over here, on would be workflow dispatch. So on workflow dispatch, we are going to run this job. We are going to check out our GitHub repository, going to remove some of the tests. And then the next step would be just print the info. And the job name, let's just name it as run manual tasks. So overall, we are going to run on workflow dispatch and the jobs would be run manual task which runs on ubuntu latest and it has two steps it's going to check out the repository and just print let me just change the print statement as well running manual tasks so it's going to run some manual task over here so now let's commit the change i'm directly going to commit it to the main branch so now we can manually trigger this workflow so if i go to actions click on manual workflow over here and then i'll click the run workflow now you can select any branch you want to run this workflow so i'm just going to select the main branch and then click on run the workflow and you can see over here now it's going to trigger a manual workflow so this is where and how you can trigger a manual workflow. And if you click here, you can see our two steps, check out repository. And we also had the info step where it's running the manual task. Uh, and if you go to actions, you can see the workflow run over here as well. So this is how you use manual workflows.